Work, working on a 2003 Subaru Forester. This one has been in an accident and both bags were deployed along with both the seat belts. So this one needs to have the airbag module reset like most cars do after an accident. They store crash data. I uh, thought I would do a little a scan. Thought I would scan it before I reset it just to see what it says, but it's just not getting communication with the module. Which is kind of strange because usually there is communication and either the light will just be on and there's no code, code stored, which indicates that there is a crash data, or it'll say crash detected. So I'm going to just go ahead and pull this module out and uh, reset it. I'll show you the whole process other than the removal procedure. Uh, the, these modules are usually located straight back behind this panel. So it requires some disassembly, so once I get it all apart, I'll show you where it's located. I got that panel all removed, and Super actually made it really easy on us here, where they angled the bolts toward this opening, unlike most modules that are just bolted straight down into the floor. So this is going to be a fairly, fairly simple removal process. Looks like the plugs all right there take a minute or so to pull out okay so i got i got it pulled out those uh screws were a lot tighter than i thought they would be so i had to break them loose with a, with a little breaker bar three eighths and then i unscrewed them with this setup Basically those bolts are security bits, torque security. They have the they have the little stem in there and size T40. And that's the only kind of security bit I had, so I had to kind of improvise. I, I got a one fourth. Uh, socket there with the adapter on the swivel Worked out all right, and then I just had to unplug it We will wiggle it out. So let's go reset this thing
wants to install and uh, I'm trying to scan it here and for some reason it still doesn't get communication I'm not sure what's going on with my scanner or the car and uh, but the light is off so I guess that's what we need and it seems to work properly right there Our airbag light stays on and goes off that's what we're looking for so I'll just call this a success not sure what's going on with my scanner but it doesn't really matter I guess these older cars are kind of harder to scan than the newer ones either way got the job done and just got to put it back together and off it goes if you need an airbag module reset, I'll include a link in the description where you can purchase the service. We only charge like $40 for most modules. Thanks for watching.